behind me, I have our new Biodrill 500. Biodrill 500 stands for 500 liter capacity. Here it's placed on one of our Temple L planters, in this case a TPL 24 rows. With the Biodrill 500 we have the possibility to have microgranulate metering system with a central hopper. I would like to show some details now and go with you to the hopper. Here we see our hopper with big capacity. In the front we have a hydraulic driven fan. That means that we need an additional hydraulic remote to drive the fan. The fan will transport our microgranulate from the metering system to the calders in the back. Talking about metering system, on the bottom of the hopper we see our well-known Phoenix 3 metering system. As you all know, we have different types of rollers for our Phoenix 3 metering system. Here we can easily change the rollers. First of all, close the hatch if the hopper is already filled. For change the roller, we have to unlock the motor and then we easily have access to the roller. You can see here. For sure, we have different types of roller, depends on the output of microgranulate. After choosing the right roller, we have to do our calibration. As you know, we have our Veda Start e-control, so the calibration is easily done standing here with our iPad looking at the metering system. Like the microgranulate is transported with a fan from the drawer to the back of the machine, I would like also to go to the back of the machine with you to our distribution heads. Here you can see one of our distribution heads. We will have one distribution head on each wing. That means with two distribution heads and also two Phoenix 3 metering systems, we have the possibility to do half side row shut off using task control. The distribution heads will divide up the microgranulate to each row unit and will transport it pragmatically to the calter. As you can see here, we have our standard microgranulate calter. Also, for the microgranulate central fill system, we have the possibility to have our three different types of calder. In this case, the rigid one open at the bottom. We also can have the rigid one close at the bottom and open behind, or the spring-loaded one. New is that part. We have a cyclone in here, because we have a very high airstream transporting the microgranulate from the front to the distribution heads to our calder. And here we might have a risk if we blow the microgranulate down with all the air that it will blow out of the ferro. But we will lose the airstream here, so the microgranulate dropped down because of its own weight. To summarize, with the Biodrill 500 we have the possibility to have a central fill microgranulate system with high capacity on our TPL models, even like here for a TPL 24 row. We have an easy calibration using our VSAT e-control and we have two electrical driven Phoenix 3 metering systems so we can do half shut off by using task control.